always been into models and uh, Panzer tank was something I always used to build and look at on a it's the German Tiger one half scale replica so it's really just like the biggest tank model I've ever built built it for paintball we went to a paintball game about two years ago and uh, it's down in Pinckney Michigan uh, big hell survivors it's the name of the field uh, it's this big paintball game they had quite a bit of people there and there were uh, these paintball quote-unquote tanks but they're all golf carts with people shooting out of them so we figured you know why not build a, a replica tank so the next time we go back we'll, we'll actually be able to call our paintball tank a, a tank. Just got a cartridge and um, it's filled with paintballs breech loading so you load it in from the back um, it's an air cannon pretty much so it's just a steel pipe with uh, some outer shrouds and inside there you've got a pressure chamber so you fill it up to a high pressure put the paintballs in pull the trigger and it'll use that air to shoot this out just like a giant spitball gun uh, we've got a scuba tank inside and uh, we use that it'll give us enough pressure for maybe 50 shots it's a three-cylinder diesel engine it used to be a generator uh, one of my co-op jobs was at a generator factory and uh, they were gonna throw it out so they let me have it and rebuilt it, put it all back together, and made it work in here. All you need is a slow moving vehicle sign apparently, and it's it's technically a tractor. Yeah, you put an orange triangle on there, you can drive it on the road. A lot of people think it's cool, but some people, some people, um, for example, like when I went back home to visit my parents, I had it on a trailer, and uh, the neighbors all called the cops saying that there was a tank rolling around their neighborhood. So uh, the cops showed up, you know, and um, they see me rolling down the street in this, and, you know, he, he just laughed. He said, you know, I've been a cop for 30 years and I thought I'd seen it all. And then uh, he told me to bring it home. 